Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we're taking a look here at ETL and SQL Tools Cheat Sheet. So let's jump into it. The Azure Data Factory is a managed service for ETL, ELT, and data integration jobs. You can create data-driven workflows for orchestrating data movement and transforming data at scale. Build ELT pipelines visually without writing any code via web interfaces. You have SSIS, the, S the SQL Server Integration Services, a platform for building enterprise-level integration data flow solutions. A low code tool for building ETL pipelines, very similar to Data Factory, but existed 15 years prior, mostly focused around SQL, no surprise there. Integrates with Azure Data Factory, so you can extend it to non relational database workloads, okay? We have Azure Data Studio, an ID similar to, a very similar to Visual Studio Code that is cross platform and works with SQL and non relational database uh, data, has many, 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 many extensions. You have SQL Server Management Studio, SMSS, an ID for managing any SQL infrastructure that only works for Windows, more mature than Data Studio, very similar in terms of parallel. So we have like the modern version that's a web, modern version that's web that's both. As like relational and non-relational, and then the older one that's mature, but is a, uh, a Windows app and does a lot of interesting stuff for SQL. You have SQL Server Data Tools, SSDT. This is a Visual Studio extension to work and design visually uh, SQL databases within Visual Studio. So there you go, we're all done.